What up YouTube? Recently people have asked me to make a video on how I had a GIF running as my background for my computer. So I thought I'd make a short video on how to do so. So it is not a free way of doing it. Obviously you could torrent the program, but then you don't get the full features and the updates coming out for it. So this is how you're going to do it. First, you obviously need Steam. Afterwards, you're going to download a or buy and download a thing called Wallpaper Engine. You can just search the store for it and it's at a low cost of $5 Canadian or like $3 US. So it's yeah, 4 450 Canadian so like 250 or like 325 US. So it's a really cheap program and whatnot and I'll be showing you the details. So after you buy the program and install it, you'll notice that uh, there might not be an icon right away at the bottom right, but if you do, go to the Steam and then uh, click play game or whatever, then it will add. Uh, so once you do so, you'll just double click it and it will pull up a window, which is then how you add more wallpapers to your computer. And you do so by just having workshop and you can search up any type of wallpaper. You obviously have anime ones, etc. And obviously I don't want to scroll because I don't want to censor the video because everything here is safe for work, but things do show up. But you can filter the results on to show only uh, certain things. So if you only want animals, then you just click it. Make sure you add it and then get rid of everything else if you want. So once you add a, uh, like once you go click on a wallpaper that you want, download it, it'll finish downloading within three seconds. Then it'll add to your installed folder and you can either make a playlist or if you only want one wallpaper then you can do so then but if you want to make a playlist then you just add a playlist you can just drag them or and whatnot so once you select a wallpaper then you have more fine-tuned settings so if you want more performance like when you're playing games or whatnot you can reduce the fps and whatnot as well as in general, uh, you there some wallpapers do have sound, but <laughs> I personally don't enjoy the sound, so I just go here and go volume mixer and mute it so the wallpapers don't have any sound behind it because when you're playing the game, it's kind of distracting. If you go to performance, you'll notice that when a different application is focused, uh, it'll keep running. So, like, if you have a tiny window like this focused, it'll keep running in the background still. When the application is maximized, so if you have a game open, it'll pause on that monitor. But if something is full screened, it'll pause on all my monitors because I do have multiple monitors because I do stream. So, I like to maximize my performance for that. Afterwards, uh, you are essentially done and you can just start adding wallpapers which you want. And... Uh, like I have different types of raindrops as someone requested because they just wanted the raindrop itself. So you have raindrops drizzle, raindrops fallout. I don't know which one was in the video, but I personally, personally love a lot of wallpapers, which I have found and you can get some low quality ones that kind of just have like a high definition, but you can also find some pretty high definition wallpapers. Like you can see here that it's a flag constantly waving. So this is how you have a running GIF as your background. And I personally hope that this has helped you. And essentially right now, this is when the video is going to end, but I kind of want to ask the audience on what my next video should be. So essentially you can close off the video if all you wanted that, but I'm just going to add a short bio now. So for this short bio, Essentially, for my next video, I'm not sure exactly what I should fo put my main focus towards. Uh, so I'm just going to ask what you guys would rather see. Uh, so I am currently making a short montage and whatnot of some pretty crazy clips that I got in Player Unknown Battlegrounds, as well as I kind of want to do a room tour because I am only 17 and I feel like sharing my room can inspire some people to do the same on working over summers, trying harder in school to achieve what I achieved. So right now I don't have the cable management fully set up yet, so it looks very clean. 
but I personally still want to do a room setup tour. So if you guys would like to see that, make sure you tell me in the comment section and make sure you thumbs up this video and subscribe and follow me on Twitch. Thank you for watching.